Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to Made with Unity Mondays for the 10th of October 2022 where I feature some of the best games, creations and everything made in Unity. Do be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the best sales, savings across game dev and so much more to save thousands of dollars. And do be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 165 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. The first is Artico Game, where they have a big thank you to the amazing Unity community for helping them reach the dream of their game. Merchant C has got a really cool stylistic environment. Resin Dev has been adding reflecting mirrors using the tiny little gecko. Omelette and Yog One tells everybody you better stay quiet. Bionic Bay has got battling against machines with some incredible looking gameplay. Tucana has got the release of Dolph Romantic where you can build your own cities, discover biomes and totally relax. Yoko OP has got an open world FPS sandbox with the development progress. Fabian Weeble has got some fun developing and look at this really unique style. Three three four four nine nine P has got four years of solo work in thirty seconds for his multiplayer strategy game. Game 3 Dover has got volumetric lighting with translucent shadow maps in Unity. That's Craig's has got his FPS that takes place inside an old computer finally has its name. Roy Rodenhauser has managed to turn an iPad into a CT scan data slicer. Wolfieboy92 is turning pages with flipbook and vertex shaders. Malbashak has got the Animal Creator 
new lavishness of 4260. Him and a friend are creating a high-rise indoor survival game in Unity HDRP. Power Snake Dev has got all the style. Creo Music is introducing a new enemy with some basic fighting mechanics. Sakura Rabbiter has got a new and improved real-time look at a hair system. A soft has got work on a see-through looking effect to simulate old school style games. The Mike the Show He's got an asteroid belt using a visual effects graph using 500k mesh particles. Rain Man Knight has got some work in progress for testing motion matching with physically based volumetric footprints. Kasper Schwadzka has got fluid simulations. Neopaker has got an attack pattern of the first boss with changing five separate units in its attacking sequence. Colin underscore K has got more movements, rope mechanics, and you can be able to stack things on each other. So be sure to check out all these games out and check out all the links in the description for all the awesome savings and sales for this month. Be sure to check out my Patreon if you want to get access to over 165 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Come and join me on Discord if you want to chat. And a big thank you to all my patrons including Peter Steiner, Raheem Whitaker, Jean Pommy, Manos Berakas, Terence Conrad, Walter Dunson, Rene Leisure, Tova Chambers, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Gatajank, Ishkawa Takuya, Ron J. Hush, Thomas Marsaleski, Callum Murray, Mark Rondu, Beast Gaming, Marvin Church, Osame Abdul, Hoglan Nigan, Nafatun, and Josh Huang. So thank you so much for coming to check this out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.